Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Cinema and Theater Break Show, where we keep it 100% Kenyan cinema and theater. And stopping by today is one of the best Kenyan actor that we have in this industry today. Xavier Uwaya. <laughs> Hope you make it your vizuri. Hey bro, me pata man. Yeah? But that was one hell of an introduction. Thank you so much. Nasimika kila siku manze nikiamka msi anafa tu kuniambia ngai hivyo. You know like one of the I best. get that introduction in the morning. <laughs> I'm good. Manze <laughs> welcome to Cinema Theater Black Show. Thank you the so much. The last time we heard you ilikuwa time luko me shoot uh, Quest Revenge. Quest Revenge. That was like 3 years ago, si ndio? I think so. Yeah. Three years ago. At Foxstone Media. Yes, 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 <laughs> yes, yes. You had done Coast Revenge, one of, uh, I think it was during that time, mm -hmm. one of the best short films that we had because it was so talking much. about real stuff that is happening yeah. in, in, this, in the society, uh, you know, uh, radicalization. Yeah. Uh, and today we are hosting you again. How has it been? Ah, uh, it's been, it's been, it's been well. And I go no coinze. And I think I'm out here. I'm out here trying to build a future for myself. Yeah. So so far so good. Mm -hmm. I'm loving the ride, manze. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, like I'm working on several projects at the moment, mm -hmm. uh, personal and also like Zawatu Engine. Yeah. Because at the end of the day, this has to work. Collaboration, partnerships, exactly. engagements, all those. Exactly. Before we just get uh, direct into this interview, I'm really interested in uh, in your story. Mm -hmm. Uh, the early, the, the beginning of, of, of your career, because I know you are a beast when it comes to theater, <laughs> you are a beast when it comes to TV. Uh, I just want to know what okay. was your journey? How did you get into this industry? Ah, okay, um, that's actually very interesting mm -hmm. because uh, <laughs> it actually happened by chance. So mm -hmm. the thing was, mm -hmm. I was looking for money to pay my college fee. Ile don't like want a foot ile kwa 30k peke yake. Okay. You know, I would have easily gone to my parents and be like, mm -hmm. you know what? I've messed up. Mm -hmm. And I need it and I need you guys to like mm -hmm. pay this amount of money. Mm -hmm. So that 30k, unonanga when you in college, mm -hmm. so the final year you're supposed to pay your you're supposed to do your project yes. and your attachment. Yes, yes. So yes. I submitted my project late. Mm -hmm. Which means it attracted a fine. So I had mm -hmm. to redo it again. Mm -hmm. And also I had like three three receipts. That mm -hmm. I had to pay. Mm -hmm. So Izo in total zilikuwa kituka athatike. But because mm -hmm. I'm a responsible man, I'm very accountable. <laughs> I was just like, you know yeah. what? Uh -huh. I'm going to own up to this. Mm -hmm. Go look for money and mm -hmm. do this. Mm -hmm. Funny thing is, do you know that Manzeni Likanje for like two years? Because now I had transcripts from that college. Mm -hmm. I'm actually a, I'm a marketing graduate. Amazing. I did, yeah, yeah, I did, Amazing. I did business management in, in college. Amazing. That's what I did. Mm -hmm. So I was like, 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 get job opportunities. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I got like very decent jobs. Mm -hmm. Did them. I was a realtor at, at some point. I was selling houses. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> I was, uh, I did, I did insurance at some point. I was like, 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 but I was like, I was Mm -hmm. At the point, I was getting very good money. Remember, I only needed 30 Gs, 30, right? 30 Gs. Nilisa your story. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I feel like at the point, <laughs> uh -huh. I wasn't, I wasn't, I wasn't, lit I wasn't financially literate. Siko na job ku manage duangu fiti. So I ended up being distracted. Yeah, yeah. Uh, with the money you are getting from insurance business. Insurance business, uh -huh. easy, 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 shugli zingine. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Ah, kuna time ilifika, uh -huh. I was just like, you know what? I feel like, kosabu. Also, my family kept on asking me, mm. yo, what's happening to your college? You know, mm. like... Tunenda graduation lini. Tunenda graduation lini. Eh, mini kwa hapo ni kwa zile za msijali, inajipanga, unajua. Eh, inakam, inakam. Inakam, inakuja, inakuja. Eh. Ilikuja for two years. Damn. So, uh, when I was still doing this, I was just like, you know what? Mm. Let me just go back home, mm -hmm. regroup. Mm -hmm. Nijue nataka kufanya nini. What do you want? Mm -hmm. What, eh, what do I want to do? Mm -hmm. Ilipatanga, it was just a random day. Mm -hmm. Kilikuwa tunabonga na msia kaniambia, eh hey, manze, mm -hmm. unaka build yako manze ni fit. Are you a model? Mm -hmm. Are you a model? Are you an actor? Are you an artist? Mm -hmm. Because he leza, hakuna njoo ilipata. This wasn't the first person who asked mm -hmm. And when was this? Which year? This was in 2014, 2015. Aha. Actually 2014. 2014. Yeah. Aha, aha. So kaniuliza hivyo nika ai, zi. Mm -hmm. Also, it's not like I wasn't watching Kenyan content, Kenyan film. Mm -hmm. I was watching. I was. I really like. Mm -hmm. 
nilikuwa napenda Kenyan content sana mm-hmm. izima cinema mm-hmm. but at that particular point nikajiambia why have i never thought about this mm-hmm. so i went online mm-hmm. started looking for like you know like acting opportunities ni nini mm-hmm. na ita imiote bado hata nikifikiria hii story mm-hmm. si ati mimi it was just like a means to an end mimi nilikuwa uh-huh. nataka kulipia college college <laughs> college fees zangu nimaliza uh-huh. nena nimaliza na eh mm-hmm. so that's how my acting career began because mm. nilianza set books yeah so i raised so that's how i raised some money and now mm. decided to go back to school mm-hmm. pay for my you know like college arrears mm-hmm. graduate and stuff mm-hmm. like that mm-hmm. na nika nika mwa, you know what i feel like niko hapa hivi you know like this is I think I love this. I love to be here. Iki mm. tunanipatia peace, inanipatia content and also I feel like I'm really good at this thing. Yeah. So that's how I that's how I decided to mm. settle into acting and pursue it as a career. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. There was there is one of the best um stage performance mm-hmm. I saw you were in at um at at Kenti. Mm-hmm. Um we were the moment the photos came out the moment because some people went to watch the play others yeah. didn't but when the photos came from that play mm-hmm. it was is it Luanda it was Luanda Rockman Luanda Rockman yeah i think if there if there's any stage plays that has been done in this yeah. industry for the past uh, uh five, six, seven years mm-hmm. i think i can count that as one of <laughs> the best the best that has ever been done so yeah. now you've joined the industry you are doing theater set mm-hmm. books and um, mm-hmm. the truth is i um i think this is something i've i've come to realize while i was say utoka theater on and tv one transition to tv how na kwanga manze the best how <laughs> how kwa the best in whatever Thank they you so do much. Yeah, so yeah. let's let's look at theater which yeah. is that one project ulifanya from theater nika ku make you you stood out from the rest of the actors from theater now you started transitioning to tv um let me take you back a little bit mm-hmm. uh so in 2018 mm-hmm. i was still doing like okay i started doing public shows in 2018 uh-huh. so now like proper shows unajua mm-hmm. unapata like a decent audience I'm, a more mature audience yes 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 and at some point someone spotted me from the plays that i was doing mm-hmm. and this was gregory q and was just like bro oh. i have a project for you you know like mm-hmm. there's a short film i want to do mm-hmm. and i'm going to send you the script and then you'll tell me if you're interested mm-hmm. so ni kapiti ya script nini nini and then we we shot it we did it mm-hmm. uh he was doing it for machaud machakos film festival yes right? yes yes the film yes, ended up yes. scooping like six awards everything nini, almost nini, everything nominated <laughs> I was nominated it, best actor and that was my debut now into film. Amazing. So, Remind us the title of that film. It was called Solo. Solo. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Babake. Yeah. Babake. Babake. <laughs> so after me uh-huh. after after now that project uh-huh. so someone saw me Justin Mirichi. So yes. you know the funny thing is uh-huh. Justin and now I'm coming to Luanda because yes, you spoke yes, about yes. Luanda. Yes, yes. Justin and the producers of Luanda mm. were doing were shooting uh, Wakamba Forever. Mm. You remember Wakamba Forever? I remember Wakamba Forever. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so actually it's the one it's the one that won that year yes, in 2019. Yes, yeah, 2019. Yeah, yeah. Best yeah. Yeah. Yes. Mm-hmm. So this guy spotted me from from Solo from and they were like, "Yo, we, wa- we want to do a project. We want mm-hmm. to do a stage pro- we want to do a stage mm-hmm. play with mm-hmm. you." And and we think this guy can make this guy is a perfect fit for our main character mm-hmm. so just immediately reached out to me and was like hey you are um tumona kazi yako manze kazi yako ni fiti mm-hmm. uh, we have a project that you are working on mm-hmm. and he actually told me it's a story about lona magere mm-hmm. hey, me manze deep down nilikuwa zile za yet uh-huh. and i've been i've been meaning to do like a lona magere story mean nilikuwa na kaivi chini niko zile za it didn't matter whether it was film uh-huh. or, stage. or stage i just wanted to the title Iliko, you were sold out exactly you were sold out from the word gone it's just like yeah me, i'm Amazing. interested mm-hmm. it's like and that was now 2019 towards the end mm-hmm. just reached out through social media mm-hmm. at kabonga so now 2019 manze mi na ngoja najua unajua also i was a young actor unajua yeah. so you you have a lot of expectations yes, nini, yes, nini. Yes, 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 yes. and also you don't understand how things are done so uh-huh. you're expecting When the year begins manzi wasa wanafa kunipigia simu. So manzi mimi niko hapo na ngoja simu. Ah kidogo kidogo sasa now uh, Langiri posted a job a call. Mm-hmm. 
440 sticks. Yes. Yeah. Amazing. Uh-huh. Yeah, Langiri posted a call for 40 sticks. Mm-hmm. Because he lays a, hey man, say, should I try it? Mm-hmm. Okay, sour. Mm-hmm. So I auditioned for it, mm-hmm. was shortlisted, nini nini. Mm-hmm. Went for that audition. Mm-hmm. Tulikuana, we had like, like three, four callbacks. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I got the role. Ita imiote, awa soja uh-huh. nipigia simu. Unangoja mirichi. Unangoja mirichi. Uh-huh. Kwa angu ni kozi leza, ai. I hope manze ingiane. Ineza kuwa a beautiful year for me. Because already, yes, yes. I already have like my first feature film now. Mm-hmm. Siku waifanya. That was my first feature. Mm-hmm. For the sticks. Yes, yes. Eh. And, and you also, are a beast in it. Exactly. You are also, a beast in it. Thank you so much. Uh-huh. Also the first main role that I ever did now in a film. Amazing. Yeah. So I was excited. Mm-hmm. So now, after I had signed the contract for 40 mm-hmm. with, uh, with Faki, mm-hmm. Wala wasa wakani pigia simu sasa. Uh-huh. Now Jay-Z, now like uh-huh. the producer, director of uh-huh. Luanda Rockman of uh-huh. Chatterbox called uh-huh. me and was like, Yo, yeah. so Justin Mirichi mm-hmm. had a conversation with you last year about a project that we intend to do. Yes. Now your time you may figure. Yes, this Ujapo is the time. Ujapo kizi uh-huh. Yo, manze awa siwa liku wana nipigia story ya project yao. Wanakaivi uh-huh. hivi chini na wasikiza ni kozile za shit. <laughs> Man, this them, is to, this uh-huh. is big. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And also for me, like uh-huh. the projects that I was doing at the time, zilikuwa, I mean, I was being casted for main roles, but mm. nafanya pale ukumbi mdogo yeah. I'd never been on the main stage. Also like... Every actor's dream is, every, how every, can I get to that main stage? Exactly. So now someone is telling me, at antakuni yako main stage, alafu pia, you know, kitu pia nafanyanga msania na kuwa happy ni do. <laughs> yeah. Manzi wa sempa kwa mesha ni ambile do wana nilipa ni kuzileza. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I'm in it. Eh, alafu unajua, it's a stage play. Unajua, yeah. it's not even a film ni nini, nini uh-huh. kuzile, unaka hivi chini ni kuzileza. Sijai lipo hidu hata kwa cinema. Mm. In my career, in my yes. young career as an yes, actor, yes, sijai lipo hidu hata kwa cinema. Uh-huh. So, I finished up with them, we signed the contract ni nini, mm-hmm. and even at, still at that time. Mm-hmm. Now, you asking me, project Ghani list and Kwazile ma project Zota nimefanya. Mm. In stage, mm-hmm. na feel Luanda Rockman was that for me. Mm-hmm. Because in the beginning, when these guys were trying to explain for me their vision, yeah. I think I still didn't see their vision clearly. Mm-hmm. Also because of my experience, yeah. or maybe because of my age. Mm-hmm. But now, as we continued, mm-hmm. unajua mm-hmm. production manzeli kwa na watu wangapi, uh-huh. ilikuwa na 150 people. And this was a, the ensemble cast. Yes. The dancers, the yes. singers, yes. The, 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 the band, mm-hmm. crew, nini nini. Mm-hmm. Ni kama kila time nilikuwa na kuja set, nilikuwa surprised. And you know, we rehearsed for like three months. Mm. Vile awasu walikuwa na leta. You know, exactly. Ah. You know, the way the actors rehearsed, we rehearsed for a month. Mm-hmm. And then kidogo, kidogo, you see the singers coming to join yes, you. Yes, kidogo, yes, kidogo, the, the dancers are the coming dancers. to join you. Uh, so for me, it was a beautiful, I mean, there. Are, I'm very sure there were actors who are part of the production who had experienced that before. Yeah. But for me, I was, kila kitu nilikuwa na experience, ilikuwa tu manze new. So I was really, I was being, I was fascinated every yes, day. Yes, yes. Yeah. That show was big. And was, even even when after um, after you had done the show, um, yeah. it was in in, uh, in newspapers. Yeah. It came out, and uh, I was looking at it. and I was like, "This is the kind of stage that we want. This 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 is our own uh, Broadway. You know, we always benchmark. <laughs> we always benchmark. Look something benchmark with. I watched Solo. Yeah. And I'm I'm very glad uh, mm-hmm. that uh, uh, Gregory Kiwo discovered you. Yeah. I watched Solo. And then there's also another shot I think I watched was around, I don't know, from Macha again. Mm-hmm. You are part of, I don't know. Yeah, so. 316 or what was it? Yeah. Okay. Um, actually, mm. let, me, let me just, let me take you through it. I love it. So I now after, it. after, after the, after, after Luanda Rockman now. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And also the thing that I loved about this production is that they gave me a totally different audience mm-hmm. that I didn't have. Mm-hmm. The uptown audience, not your audience. Unajua ile audience, wala wase wa you guy, my guy. Yeah. Awa sali nipatia yo audience. Yes, yes, yes. Audience. Uh-huh. I mean, zile mashon ili kwa nafanya, sita ni kawa sali kwa raziona. Yes, yeah. yes, yeah. But now also, I got a chance to network with a totally, a, a different group of uh-huh. creatives. Uh-huh. Unajua? Uh-huh. And these people gave me my next project, uh-huh. which was Tomboya now. 
Yes. Because I met a totally different group of creatives who are storytellers. Mm -hmm. Them, they are doing narrative theater. Mm -hmm. They are called Tuoli for Birds. Yes. Exactly. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You asking me how I've been able to like establish my career as a, as a mm -hmm. stage actor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I feel giving like giving you another opportunity after another. And even changing your perspective as an artist or as a creative, oh, giving you God. like wana kupatia the possibilities zile mm -hmm. mm -hmm. because as an actor I feel like at times you're always like boxed. Mhm. Mm Una yonga tu mahali unaambiwa hizi ndo shows unafaa kufanya kama yeah. this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But these these people gave you um diversity, you are versatile. Exactly. And 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 uh, let's talk about uh 40 sticks. Yeah. 40 sticks is one of those shows, movies I'm using to benchmark. Mm -hmm. I, I have friends that uh they are, they are this they are this type of people they don't think we have kenyan content okay so every time i interact with them these are people who are in business uh who are not close to art okay. so every time we talk on anambia what, what are you guys doing cuz they are interested with what i do cuz everywhere i go uh, you ask me what do you do i tell you i'm a filmmaker and they ask me how is that business in your country is there anything out there from kenya mm -hmm. i always tell them go to netflix Watch 40 Watch sticks. 40 sticks. Uh, that's what I use yeah. so that they can see we have this type of type of content. Yeah. How was it creating 40 sticks? 40 man says 40. Because I watched you guys were in the forest all the time. 40 was amazing. Mm -hmm. Also, also, that was the first time I was really I was working in a film with like seasoned actors. Yes. When you were the likes of Kina Robert Agengo, mm -hmm. Kina Bilal Moura, mm -hmm. Arab Ron. Yes. Uh -huh. Like I think I was I was the only I was the only young actor in that group. Mm -hmm. I was in Guinea. These guys are doing like. And you like, killed it. I Bana. killed it. You killed. But it was amazing. Uh -huh. you know, like even working with Gatoni. Because that was my first experience working with Gatoni, Gatoni as, an exp, uh -huh. as a... A season director. No, as a season director. Mm -hmm. Because he's one of those directors we call an actor's director. Mm -hmm. Like, mm -hmm. he, already, he can already see what you want to do even before, like... You do it. You do it. Amazing. Exactly. So it was, uh -huh. it was so easy. And also, like, being able to be in a space with all these actors who've done it for... Who, like... We've been doing this for a while. For the longest time possible. Yeah. Wana ku correct am wana ku guide. Unajua? Eh sasa zile wanataka kufanya mistake kwa zile za maybe try this. Try doing it this way. Unajua? But also for me, I think your project ili at a point in life where I really I was really I really also passionate. Nili kwa nataka tu kufanya. Yes, yes. Nili nataka tu kupiga show. And from from look of things uh Xavier now na your journey is 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 very interesting journey because yeah. from the moment you came in you've been from something into something and the best thing yeah. you're also going out there to audition you're also connecting with other people yeah. there is there's a kid who is watching today mm -hmm. who wants to join this film industry mm -hmm. i always get those type of messages um and I like how Gen Z's these days they text they just <laughs> go straight to the point can i act in your films and they're like <laughs> I ask them, do you have a headshot? Mm -hmm. Do you have a show reel? Do you have anything? Do you have a monologue? What can you tell these kids? Because now they're just coming in and look at you. You were spotted. You did not settle. You went on to another project. Ukafanya ingine. But still, you went to audition. And, and I believe you're also going to other auditions. Yeah. Mm. Hey, first of all, I feel like I'm wana fa kwanza kulo expectations zao because i always feel, <laughs> I always feel uh -huh. like as a young creative or as a young actor uh -huh. unakuja nga kwa industry na expectation flan uh -huh. na tena siezi blame to yote ni kwa sababu ya zile vitu unaona anga zikifanywa maju na that the pia industry yetu iko hivyo yeah. but they also have to realize that we are it's a growing industry we are still mm -hmm. a small industry na bado tunajaribu kupata maki yetu in the world yes 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 so you need to lower your expectations mm -hmm. but also you need to be prepared mm -hmm. to put in the work mm -hmm. but pia unafakuwa na ile heart to heart conversation na yourself no is this really something that i want to do mm -hmm. eh, because just like any other career lazima tu manze we invest 10000 hours in it. you have to be ready to put in the work in it yeah eh, and it's so it's unfortunate, or maybe I wouldn't say you can say many unfortunate or unfortunate mm -hmm. that atuna systems, especially zile zinafunza, atuna atuna shule za acting. Mm. Unajua? Mm -hmm. Ziko, mm -hmm. but Ziko. 
<laughs> so unajua even as an actor yes, as emoji yes. kumi yes yes you know mm-hmm. we are living in a digital uh, digital age pale mm-hmm. unaweza kwa youtube mm-hmm. unaweza lipia master class pale hivyo mm-hmm. nini nini mm-hmm. unajua mm-hmm. so for me it's just being prepared being ready to put in the work yeah eh. mm-hmm. na pia also i mean it's the advantage that they have mm-hmm. is that pia kwa kwa era mazetu kwa na a lot of acting coaches Yes, we yes, have yes, a lot yes. of acting coaches. both in person and online. Both in person nini nini unajua mm-hmm. even like acting workshops. Yes, yes. So yes, kuna hizi yes. vitu. So even before wanting to be part mm-hmm. even before approaching like a creative a director mm-hmm. or even mm-hmm. an actor and telling mm-hmm. them that you want to be part of their project. Mhm. Manze kuna vitu zingine unafaa kufanya. Jitume. Jitume kwanza. Eh, jitume kwanza. Amazing. Eh. What, what keeps you going? What keeps you going? Ah. Uh, passion mm-hmm. passion you've always wanted to do this i've always wanted to do this mm-hmm. yeah sidhani kama kuna kitu kingine naweza taka kufanya mm-hmm. so that that is what keeps me going unaona unaona vile daktari ama lawyer na mkanga kila asubuhi mm-hmm. anaenda kufanya ile kitu anapenda mm-hmm. manze hiyo ndio kitu nani keep going yeah. alafu pia mungu anga ambitious mm-hmm. i have dreams mm-hmm. uh, mai kuna kuna wase wase fulani muziki zangu anaitwa ngao kardinali anasema <laughs> nga kuna mahali nafaa kwenda nani sai eh na fili kama i have things to do i have places to go right now right now <laughs> yeah. and they can't waste any time you know yes, to yes, manzina yes. ni keep going yes eh. yes yes amazing so you to your 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 hunger to ya kutaka mm-hmm. to ku grow mm-hmm. eh. this industry um uh, i believe kuna vitu zenye wase kupitia mm. once in a while um from the journey that you've had do you have something you can say this was my lowest moment you almost maybe stepped out from the industry but yeah. because of that passion that mm-hmm. you've said keeps you going mm-hmm. made you just to focus back in the industry now and then keep going um yeah na feel ni kama especially as as, as creatives mm-hmm. right Mm-hmm. tunafika ngamali una realize especially after doing a long term project mm-hmm. ama especially after having like a lot of projects your way mm-hmm. so una than ni kama hivi ndo vile vitu zitaran ama mm-hmm. vitu zitaran nyingi mm-hmm. mm-hmm. and then you get to a place where and these are seasons easy seasons in akwanga mm-hmm. ile season hakuna kitu yote inaendelea mm-hmm. so it comes and you know you have yeah. to either do your personal projects mm-hmm. look for collaborations ufanye nini nini mm-hmm. So eh hey, I think kuna time siko na understand hizo dynamics. Mm. And if, that was a, that was a crazy that was a, that <laughs> So who could I expect project after, after project, project project after project That was a that was a time nili question kama nataka kuendelea na hii career ama ama wachane nayo. Eh nataka kufanya career nyingine. Mm-hmm. So when so this that was, mm-hmm. that was that was yeah that was that point for me. Uh-huh. But the good thing mm-hmm. about that point was I had So you know it mentor zamani wa ite nini. Mm. I had people on my side wale waliniambia wali wali niita chini wali nikalisha chini waka mm-hmm. advice. Mm-hmm. Wakaniambia mm-hmm. manze industry yetu this is how our industry works. Mm-hmm. Eh. This is how it goes. <laughs> this is how it goes. Now you 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 you've, yeah. you've going through this moment. Um unaashanga like should I step out should I keep uh, stay in yeah. there is this situation that we have and this is about mental wellness yeah. for for creatives. Yeah. Most of them especially who are coming in now as for you mm-hmm. how come you understand your point mm-hmm. there are those who now come in maybe they don't have that that community or group ya wasai kuambia eh bro mm-hmm. oh, relax relax umefanya project moja mbili tatu umekaa three months on a project relax how how do you deal maybe when it comes to mental m- mental mental let me say mental beat down How, how do you deal with it even in your lowest moment in this industry what, what, how do you deal with such situations that makes you not to go into depression i think for me um, the only way muji making it's it's i do other stuff mm-hmm, mm-hmm. you know like um nilielewa kwanza i first had to understand that my whole life is not is not based on acting alone mm-hmm. unajua niko na familia niko na mabeshte mm-hmm. eh and also like i said as you are kuna pia zile vitu napenda kudu yeah. aside from acting you mm-hmm. know like 
For example, I'm open up to the chess. Oh, amazing. And so I like playing basketball. I like going to the gym. Amazing. Working out, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So there's so much. And also, like, I'm also trying to, like, create partnerships. Uh-huh. And uh-huh. also mm-hmm. just, like, be my own employer. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, in a way mm-hmm. that mm-hmm. I don't rely on, on someone on, to on, employ me. On, yes, on one source, on of, one income. source of income. Exactly. And this is good. This is good. Talking yeah. about partnership, there is always this uh, a group of you I normally see. Yeah. This is you, uh, Isaboke, uh, Anto, and Anto... And to uh, bullet head, uh, <laughs> okay. The <laughs> Munakwanganaka group, I see most of the time you guys are, are doing something, even if it's not commercial, yeah. it's just for you. What do you think is the importance of partnership and collaborations among artists themselves? <clears throat> the importance of that is growth at mm-hmm. the end of the day. Because mm-hmm. especially in a corporate setting, mm-hmm. Someone will want to do after they've done their degree, yeah. and maybe they've got a job somewhere. Or they can find a master's house so that they can get a job, or so that they can move to the next level. Mm-hmm. So even as an artist, as an actor, mm-hmm. do you really want to act forever? You know, like even look at Hollywood. You mm-hmm. realize side and zela me direct movie ka moja. Unajua. Ah, juzi ni likuwa nangali ya movie flani atom kluni. Johnny George Clooney. Eh, hey, I'm a direct. Mm-hmm. Like, even as an actor, so apu yun doctu I think ina to peleka, ina to push out of our comfort zones. Cause mm-hmm. abu na mm-hmm. We even look at the producers, mm-hmm. the producers mm-hmm. who are giving us work at the moment. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Most of them are from a different generation. Yes, yes. yes. But then it begs the question: Who's mm-hmm. going to employ us? Mm-hmm. Si mm-hmm. After they are uh, gone. After, after, after they are gone. Uh-huh. Who's going to create those opportunities? Uh-huh. So now that's where we come in. Mm-hmm. Unajua. Partnerships and um, and collaborations mm-hmm. is something I it, it's really needed in the industry. Now I, I will tell you for the for to be honest, I love what you guys are doing. I love what you guys are doing. And um, Anto Anto is a good friend of mine. Very soon to more staffa. Pia is a boke. is a good friend of mine. I'll, I'll host him. So let's talk about uh, uh, global recognition. Okay. Is there any project you've done and you've received uh, recognition globally? Uh, Forty Stick still mm-hmm. has to be that project. Amazing. Yeah, I was nominated Best Actor for the AMA Awards. Amazing. Yeah, yeah. And this is a hard work. Hard work and sweat and everything. Did you prepare for Forty Sticks in terms of wh- while filming? Did you have like a background preparation really like you went into it serious before filming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, not... Did I? Mm-hmm. You're a natural. <laughs> no, yeah, so, uh, so of course, I mean, I did the basics. Yeah. I did the basics, which mm-hmm. is just like analyzing your script and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. You know, and also like, it's a good thing that we had like enough time with the director. Oh, okay. You know, just sit down, mm-hmm. talk about the story, mm-hmm. break it down, understand mm-hmm. our characters better. Mm-hmm. You know, you going back home, doing yeah. the research, mm-hmm. you know, like after knowing what the story is about, mm-hmm. like, just doing your personal research, trying mm-hmm. to also understand, like, mm-hmm. where are you coming from? Why is this story set, set up? Mm-hmm. Why is it being done in mm-hmm. Kenya? Unajua? Because I'm not feeling this as in Guinea. Si ukonga neo no maya, we pati wa script, we pati wa story, ama yo working on this production or this project. And wewe wala tu na angalia, ni wase wa mayolo. Unajua, that's where you're born. That's where you're getting your research, which is not bad uh-huh, as uh-huh. where you're borrowing from like mm-hmm. like but lakini kuna vitu zingine kama mannerisms i'm saying unajua ka for example nataka yeah. kuact ka mbaba waduka ama ama just an ordinary kenyan person yeah, unajua yeah, yeah. mwalimu wa mm-hmm, mm-hmm. lazima tu ni mm-hmm. kae chini ama ni, ni observe mm-hmm. mseka ni ni understand vile umsema nzi anafikiria vile mm-hmm. umsema ana dress mm-hmm. zile mm-hmm. masto anapiganga mm-hmm. eh. Kenyan way a, a, Kenyan way a, a, and this is something eh. uh, I will also I, I wanted to ask you just before it, it passes me eh. your create your creative process uh-huh. would you say this is some of your creative process let me say Lodeki has given you a script eh. for a new movie now you've been casted for a role mm-hmm. how do you prepare for that particular role ah uh, so first of all, mm-hmm. uh, especially uh, the, the, the past few projects that I've worked on, mm-hmm. I've had the advantage of working with, a, with an acting coach. 
Amazing. Kwa sababu mm-hmm. unaona ngayo ni kitu watu naanga si udha ningi director anafa ku acting coach. Yeah. Director anafa ku double up as uh-huh. acting <laughs> hey, coach. But there are some productions that understand that. Uh-huh. You know uh-huh. like bringing an acting coach on board. Mhm. Uli ataku guide. Alafu unajua pia someone who understands maybe the project that you've done previously and mm-hmm. the project that you're doing now. Mm-hmm. Ataku saidia pia ku the role mm-hmm. or even to build a character from yes, scratch. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Uh-huh. So there's that. Mm-hmm. So but also there is me as an actor mm-hmm. now nimebaki na script kejani. Unajua? Na katu chini na jaribu ku ku internalize kitu, na jaribu mm-hmm. ku understand. But also at times uh, I try as much as I can. Sasa zingine mu mu penanga tu kutoka hapa, kutoka tu kwa nyumba tu kwenda mm-hmm. tu mahali kwa soko mm-hmm. ama mahali tu tao tu nitulie tu base tu na wase tu nisikie tu bila sana bonga yes yes eh, kwa sababu maybe ume, umekastiwa kama maybe gangster flani kama umekastiwa kama gangster flani ama boy wa mtaani lazima u get into these guys exactly mwende zabe lazima unajua tu for any artist zingine unachanga tu imagination yako hii itekova itekova kwa sababu kama gangster mm. we gangster mgani unajua <laughs> <laughs> kuna 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 best yangu flani yuko nasema alikosema hapa Kenya manzi hatu na magangster hakuna hatuna hatuna tiase hatuna zi hawajui hawajui wako bana hawajui usikia kuna time wasao alichimbanga banku huko ni wapi fika Uh, wasi u Kenya wezi wako. That's a decent pa- bro wasi wasi that's a decent garden come to the studies. Wewe msi anajua shit yake. Wewe msi ana understand kitu anafanya. No like that's an intelligent oh sorry i mean jaribu ku justify crime like you say man. That intelligent for you be no. Exactly. But it's true it, 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 I think like people that. they, they are categorized. We have we have organized crime. Exactly. Ah uh, we have robbers wale 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 wanakwanga spontaneous i can feel <laughs> your phone end ra but kuna wale organized amazing but also amazing. also mm-hmm. also uh, i mean kuna advantage ya mm-hmm. kuna place ka kitumu penanga there is this documentary that was it Muhammad Ali who was doing mm-hmm. where alikuwa na interview like prisoners It, it, it has to be them Muhammad Ali ama mm, ama Alanam Alanam Eh yeah, yeah. sasa zingine mm-hmm. mukanga chini mm-hmm. na watch trees of documentary yes, kwa sababu yes. nataka kuunderstand how they pia mm-hmm. I mean if given a role like that mm-hmm. then I don't want to understand where these guys are coming from mm-hmm. kwa sababu na feel kila mse manzi ana kuangana story yake mm-hmm. me I don't I try as much not to judge the characters I do amazing yeah. amazing yeah. let's talk about generally the the industry um What do you feel about the current state of the Kenyan film industry? Film and TV industry. Ah, uh, I feel like we've really grown. Mm-hmm. As an industry. Mhm. Kwa sababu manze muka ngaivi chini na angalia ama times nasikiza stories za kina mzee wa Juam. Yeah. Unajua? Yeah. Ndio hasa alikuwa anaishenga kupiga job. Ndio yeah. anatembea sijui kutoka wapi hadi yeah. tao. Yeah. And at times they weren't even being paid. Mm-hmm. Unajua? Mm-hmm. And we are getting to a point where msanii anaweza kaa hapa chini. Mhm. And ya patiwe contract ya kama ya katatu anafanya TV show. Mm-hmm. And you're being paid good money, unajua? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Na siku ubaya lakini mu feeling as much as as creatives tunasema ati atulipwe ndio ile tunafaa kulipwa lakini mm-hmm. na feel pia ile ndio tunalipwa ni decent na decent na kujipanga mm-hmm. tuko mali mm-hmm. so we've really grown as an industry mm-hmm. but even 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 in the quality mm-hmm. of the content that we're producing yeah. you know our films mm-hmm. our TVs mm-hmm. ato kiangalia zile ma stories tunafanya mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. the other day feel it did like click click bang yes which was based on a true story mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. stories ngapi ka hizo zimefanywa hapa Kenya Majua so we are, we are, we are, we are really pepeta. Yes, yes, yes. Majua. Mm-hmm. Eh, and many other sto- many mm-hmm. other many mm-hmm. other shows that are car is mm-hmm. zile zimefanywa but mm-hmm. also we are at a, we are a point where manzi unapata unaingia hivi set na msanii even actors. Unajua mm-hmm. I'm really me mapia zwangu mm-hmm. and even the the younger actors. Mm-hmm. At times you're on set with your fellow actors na kaivi timu ajambia manzi This person has really done their homework. They really they really putting in the work. Mm-hmm. 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 Uh, yeah, yeah. But you can understand can even feel that feedback when you're on the ground. Unajua kutana na mafans msi yako ndio manze. Ile show the kill. But even you have those loyal fans who keep telling you. Yeah. I can see the growth. Mm-hmm. Like unajua. Mm-hmm. Hey. Mm-hmm. So 
for me, I think we've really grown as an industry. In all we've aspects. come from somewhere. In all aspects, eh? Mm -hmm. we've come from and I'm, I'm loving it because I am loving it because uh, before we, we just started discussing this, I was telling you, yeah. if there is anyone who is joining this industry yeah. in the year 2025, what a kwana pressure, especially mm -hmm. in terms of content, acting, because especially when actors you guys you guys are you guys are you guys are amazing and you're one of those actors that uh, mm -hmm. i'm really 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 looking forward mm -hmm. to work with in terms of just to in a movie or a tv series mm -hmm. or something because you guys have also you've shifted the industry from where we just used to see that they, we used to call them model actors mm -hmm into actors who are bringing the story to life yeah. where you are now have mm. you identified your acting style myself mm -hmm. but that's the thing mm -hmm. that's the thing about acting styles uh -huh. acting styles mm -hmm. <laughs> and also like isn't if you really learn making the industry yes you, yes you know someone tells you to learn about Stanis stanislavski mm -hmm. mm -hmm. method mm -hmm. acting yes eh, meisner uh -huh. is about techniques uh -huh. Nona. Uh -huh. so i wouldn't say that i have an acting style mm -hmm. as i say my too i've been keen enough to learn Mm -hmm. Listeners I learn, mm -hmm. but I'm also a student of life. Mm -hmm. you keep on learning. I keep on learning. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so mm -hmm. I don't really, I don't have a particular acting style at this point. Now, I'm only gonna do my own thing. I'm a method actor. But then, if you come here, I change. Like I've been doing, I'm gonna do my own thing. Sivani, Sivani. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. it's 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 more comp. It's there's more to it than meets the eye. Mm -hmm. <laughs> see, see. Do you have like some guys when you, you look up to, like maybe they are into particular acting techniques that you, know, you look up to because uh, there are people who look at maybe themselves or maybe locally or internationally. Do you have such actors you look up to? Uh, <laughs> locally. Yeah, locally and uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, locally you look up to yourself. <laughs> ah, Come uh, on, man. Of, of course, uh, can I say uh, uh, <laughs> jobs are to Ali is an inspire. You know, like uh -huh. an inspire from the uh -huh. For example, on stage, mm -hmm. you know, I see someone like Martin Kigondu. Yes. Martin Kigondu. Yes, yes. I've watched his Two man show yeah. of yeah, I've watched his one That's of the shows. That's a seasoned actor. Mm -hmm. That's someone who understands what he what he's doing. Mm -hmm. Now, and I feel like as a theater actor, mm -hmm. there's so much I can learn from, from him like that. From mm -hmm. yeah, uh, who else? Mm -hmm. Globally, in terms of film. No, I, I was, I was, I was. I wanted to talk about film still in Kenya. Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, Even Raymond Fuller. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Raymond Fuller. Raymond Fuller is uh he's really manze he's been he's been he's been there. He has been there. You know, and, and you know, sub, one thing that I admire about him mm. is that Manze Amekua how old is he? Manze he's is, he's old. He's, he's old. <laughs> yes. This guy is still, they're called golden age. Yeah. Yeah. He still goes to the gym gym and works out. Mm -hmm. Kutana na yeye kwa set is very disciplined. Very, Unajua? very, very. Eh, mm -hmm. and I understand ile kitu anafanya. Mm -hmm. He'll be there on time. Mm -hmm. Nini? Mm -hmm. But even ukiangalia skill yake manze, mm -hmm. ni kitu ame grow mm -hmm. from time. Na manze, yeah, mm -hmm. so me mseka huyo manze ana blowing. Mm -hmm. There's I a see, time, see, there's I a see, time. I see him work and I get mm -hmm. mind blown. There's a time we were, yeah. they were, they were filming a, a movie. It's called, um, there's a time they were filming a movie and we were there to to cover the behind the scene and yeah. interact with them. By that time we were very young. We were very yeah. young. I, yeah. I'll share with you that clip. Yeah. You'll see him. The guy was very thin. Uh, I was <laughs> I, <laughs> I was I was very young and they were doing that film and we were there just to cover the story behind the scene. Uh, and we were so afraid to which, interview him. Which film was that? Um, fa family meeting. Family meeting. Ah, family yes. meeting. Family what meeting. What do you mean you're very young? Family meeting you have on your 2019, Baba. Bro, no, no, we were very young. I think these two, these two, no, these no, two no, years. I met you, I met you on family meeting. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. I don't think you're young. We were very young. You know what I'm going to say? 
<laughs> you should look at those clips, bro. Okay, let me say you are very tiny. We are very tiny. Okay, so we were very afraid to interview him. Uh-huh. We interviewed some of the actors easy. Mm-hmm. And we were very afraid. We were thinking, how can we approach Raymond yeah, to yeah. talk to him? And the moment we approach, it was so easy. It was so easy. He talked to us like he knew us from somewhere else. The Welcome to us. I'm telling you. Which is something to be admired by us young actors. You should. And also be emulated. You should. <laughs> and looking at, the, looking at his filmography, yeah. ah, I love, I love Raymond Ofula. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm glad he's one of the, the actors you look up to yeah. uh, locally. He's a good, he's a, he's a, he's a good person. Yeah, yeah. Um, and, and globally, do you have actors you look up to globally? Globally. Uh, Al Pacino. Mm-hmm. And there is... Joe Pesci, mm-hmm. Daniel Day Lewis. The mm-hmm. list is endless. Mm-hmm. But also, like these are method actors. So. Yes. So you, yeah. you, so your technique is method acting. As much as you might That's run people... away from it, <laughs> as what... much as you might run away from it, yeah. your technique is method acting. Yeah. Amazing, amazing, Xavier. Um, I'm so glad to have you on this show. Okay. And um, I had I had a long list of things to ask you. Mm-hmm. But you've exhausted it in 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 uh, in, a, in a, a nice way that we've covered almost everything okay. that I. You are one of those actors, you know. You can have this conversation today, tomorrow, <laughs> and you can sk- keep on talking about it. Yeah. Let, do you have? Um, let's talk about your future aspirations in the industry. What what, what is in store for for your audience? One of our expect nini mafanso wako. Ah, when I expect growth, mm-hmm. but Pia, I'm planning. I'm planning. I'm, I'm <clears throat> not. I'm planning. I've ni mengi a production side, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. you know. So maybe also more projects mm-hmm, being mm-hmm. produced, being mm-hmm. directed, mm-hmm. being created by mm-hmm. myself. Mm-hmm, yeah. Mm-hmm. So that's what they need to expect. Mm-hmm. Like I said, growth too. Growth. Uh, Any show that you are in, they should. Um, they should tune in and where any show that yeah, you are in. Uh, there's a new show. There, mm-hmm. there are so many projects that are coming. Currently, okay. I'm not supposed to uh-huh. <laughs> mention their titles yes, yes. or mention their names because uh-huh. yeah, yeah. Nini, nini, nini. I know. Yeah, mm-hmm. but there's so many. I have a lot of projects that I did last year. Mm-hmm. Some of them that are yet to premiere, that mm-hmm. are yet to be released this year. Some mm-hmm. of them that I'm still working on. Okay. And are still in the pipeline. Mm-hmm. So yeah. Amazing, amazing. So There's much in store. So, so much in store. Yeah. There is a kid today uh-huh. is watching this show. He follows you everywhere. Yeah. He wants to know. Um, he, he admires your acting. He admires your work. I may watch your, your shows. And one of the reasons why I called you on this show is because I'm your biggest fan. Mm-hmm. I watch your content and I'm like, <laughs> this guy, this guy. <laughs> this is something that you tell all your guests. No, 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 no. I don't. I, I don't. feel like all your guests are your biggest fans. No, 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 no. I, no, no, for you, for yeah. you is the truth. For you is the truth. And, and you can see most of your projects, I'm aware. I've watched your projects. I watch solo. I, like... I'm, I'm, I've been following your career and everything. I'm always on, when I go to Instagram, I have specific people. I normally want just to see what are they up to. I check, I check, I check, I check, I check, I leave. There's this kid who wants to join this industry today. They look at you and they're like, Manze, I want to act like Xavier. What would you tell them? Follow your dreams. Mm-hmm. Follow if it, if this is something that you love, if this is something that your heart desires, pursue it. Let no one, not, let nothing stop you. Just pursue it. If it feels right in your heart, ah, before ate, you just come back to your ate. Yeah. Amazing, amazing. My people, you've heard it from Xavier. You wire. That's. I, I'm getting it correct, right? Yeah, you're getting Z- it correct. Xavier Iwaya. This is one of the best actors this country 
as ever have and um wacha kucheka it's the truth it's the truth <laughs> It's the truth. <laughs> <laughs> like um, you see, you yeah. can you can use your journey to gauge if you're good. Yeah. You start, someone picks you up, you go to audition, someone picks you up, you go to another audition, someone picks you up. Mm-hmm. This shows there is something these directors are looking for. Yeah. There is something these producers are looking for. Mm-hmm. And thus you have it. Because um I've been lucky to sit on a director's seat, to sit on actor's seat, to sit on producing seat. Mm-hmm. The moment you receive a list of cast members, um, casting director come to you and tell you, tukonauyu, tukonauyu, tukonauyu. they show you the casting tape, they show you like, we have these three to work with. Yeah. You look at it, you look at it, and then the casting director tells you, I can work with this one. Mm-hmm. Um, even you as a producer, you look at it and you're like, okay, how about this one? Okay, because as a producer, you also have a little bit of say yeah. in terms of the talent you're looking for, yeah. and you you get people like you on most of these shows. You choose them, you choose them, you choose them. That shows you are among the best actors. So before we leave, before we leave, Xavier, we want uh, we want just to prove on this show if you're an actor. <laughs> we know you are, <laughs> but we want to give you a monologue. We want you to give us a monologue uh-huh. of your choice. Um, very short, very snappy, so that our audience can stamp okay. on CTV show Xavier. Yeah, you're really this. putting me on the spot. Yes, but anyway, uh, all right. Of a monologue. Let me do something different. I'll give you a poetry. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. Let's do that. Okay. Out of the night that covers me, black as a pit from pole to pole, I thank whatever gods might be for my unconquerable soul. In the fell clutch of circumstance, I have not winced, nor cried aloud. Under the bludgeonings of chance, my head is bloody, but unbowed. Beyond this place of wrath and tears looms, but the horror of the shed. And yet the menace of the ears finds, and shall find me unafraid. It matters not how straight they get, or how child with punishment the scroll. I'm the master of my fate, and I am the captain of my soul. Wow, 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 wow. It still sounds like a monologue to me. <laughs> it still sounds like a monologue to me. Yeah. I am the captain of my soul. And I am the master of my fate. I am the master of my fate. I am the captain of my soul. I'm captain of my soul. Mm-hmm. Bro, <laughs> when I say you're the best, you're the best. Uh, thank you, thank you so much. You are the best. And on this show, CTB show, we give you your flowers when you're still around, Asante. when you're still here. Asante. So that you don't want someday, sometime, because we know someday we will all live. Yondo Safari Akilam Okay? And yeah. when you're still here, yeah. we're giving you your flowers. Thank you so, Thank you so much, so much for coming to Cinema and Theater Break Show mm-hmm. to share your story. Yes. Now everyone knows your journey. <laughs> now everyone knows where you started. Yeah. So when they see you now, especially for the guys in the industry mm-hmm. or who are coming in the industry, mm-hmm. Wasidani to uh, Xavier woke up Nakafika on 40 sticks akapiga ile show wazimu ama overnight success yes yeah. it, it is not overnight it's not microwaved yeah. it's something that you worked for exactly. from day one and you never stop for sure for sure from cinema and theater break show bro <laughs> we want to wish you all the best in all your uh, in all your projects that are coming i know you've done a lot of projects uliniambia so behind the scenes but you taki kusema hapa which is allowed so guys i want you to follow Xavier online on all his social media platforms you are you on instagram yeah i'm on instagram i'm on instagram i'm on twitter instagram as you are Xavier, mm-hmm. twitter savinsky mm-hmm. uh, tiktok facebook tiktok you are mm-hmm. Xavier. Amazing. Mm-hmm. Guys, follow your Xavier on all his uh, social media handles, all platforms, so that you can tap into his creative aspect. Whatever he's doing out there, keep in touch with him. And you may have a question on maybe how can I get into my character? DM him 
he will respond. Guys, follow Cinema and Theatre Break Show on all social media platforms. We are on on we are on X, as they call it. X. <laughs> we are on TikTok. We are on, on on Facebook, and we are on Instagram, and we are on uh, YouTube. Like, comment, subscribe, and remember this show. This episode is proudly proudly shot at Hoyo Fire Creatives. We are located at Brickwood Apartments, Lantana Road, Westlands. Remember this space is available for all your shoots whether you're doing um, a talk show whether you're doing a podcast we have all the sets for you come here create your content from this space from me to you i wish you all the best and let's keep making the world a better place to live in i'm your host lodeki vincent thank Bye. you for hosting me lodeki karibu sana and every time you have a show yeah. come here let's talk about it before for sure, you launch for sure, for sure. asante